Hey, what's up guys? This is MJ and today let's do some used car shopping for a Dodge Challenger. That's right. Today we're going to shop for some cool cars. You guys know when I look at used cars, I like to try to find the Carfax. But first, let's take a look at it. This one is a 2016. Let's see, I don't know these people. I'm just randomly looking at cars on the internet. So we'll see. Look at that. Oh man, that's awesome. This is just a modern day classic. There is nothing else you could say about that. Look at that. I want this car. This one is a stick shift too. V8 with the Hemi. Oh man, it's a stick shift. <laughs> I think most of these come in automatic, but yeah, there we go. So, um, what I like to do is find the dealership website and then I will go on there and try to find the Carfax. Where are you? Here we go. Dealer website. All right. So here we go. We're on the dealership website. Let's go ahead and see if we can find the Carfax. Here we go. All right. So here we go. I've been noticing that some of these Dodge Challenger Carfaxes, it's hard to find a perfect one but you could find one that's not too bad. See, this one got some minor damage to the front. Looks like uh, they'll tell you if the airbags went off. So it doesn't look like the airbags went off. So that's good. Let's see, do we have any maintenance on here? Fluids checked, check, check. Oil filter change, all right. Oil and filter, oil and filter. All right, well, at least somebody took care of it. Oil filter, tire replaced, oil and filter. Cabin air filter replaced. All right, this ain't bad. See, this is California. They got emissions inspections. So there's no check engine light. You're not going to pass inspection with a check engine light on. So damage to left front and right front. Oh, this don't look too bad. Alignment checked. That's not a good sign. After an accident, three months after an accident, alignment checked. Well, it looks like it's all right. Uh, if I were to get this car, I would definitely have a mechanic check it out. You could also have a mechanic take it to a shop and put it on the alignment rack. Make sure that uh, all of your toe and your camber and your caster and everything's okay. They also have alignment angles like uh, SAI, steering access inclination, which will tell you if like, if maybe a knuckle was bent or something, it'll, it'll show, that'll show bad. But, uh, but yeah, if I were you, I'd have somebody check it out before you buy it, but it looks like it's got some maintenance. So that is a good sign. All right, here we go. Black on black. Oh man, that's baller. Does baller status? I want to buy this car. <laughs> I want to buy that orange one. I want both of them. So like this video so I could get rich off of YouTube money. And then I could buy both of these cars. <laughs> oh, look at that. This one, one of these tires a little low. Maybe it's got a nail in it or something. Just uh, any used car though, have somebody check it out before you buy it. Have a mobile mechanic come, and they can meet you at the shop and check it out. Bob Roarman. All right, so here we go. Some more pictures. Man, that car is awesome. It's only 40,000 miles on it. This one got the automatic transmission, but it looks like it's got the, the eight speed transmission. That's the one you want. That is the, the ZF transmission. That is the good one. ZF is a German company. They make transmissions, but they make pretty good ones. They also make the transmission for the Supra and a lot of BMWs too. All right, show me the car effects. All right, so here we go. This one got an accident too. <laughs> this is a little one it looks like. I guess that's not a big deal. Let's not let the perfect be the enemy of the good. All right, so vehicle, nitrogen filled tires, paint protection applied. They got the paint protected, oil filter. 
oil and filter change at 3,500 miles. Oh, wow, well, somebody cares about you. And again, at 78,000 miles. Well, they ain't getting all the oil filter change. And they sold it already. <laughs> Why didn't you keep it so you could get, take better care of it? Take care of it forever. All right, the next guy taking care of it. Oil and filter. Oil and filter every 3,000 miles. This one looks a little further away, but front door latch, oil filter, little accident day. That ain't too bad. That ain't too bad. I think that one definitely deserves a look. Go check it out with your mobile mechanic. Okay. All right. Let's look at some for a random one. Let's see what happens. What color you guys like? Neon. What is this? Green? Orange and green? That looks weird. I don't like that color. White. White doesn't seem like a good color for a Challenger. Challenger should be orange. Like the Dukes of Hazard car. Thank you very much. Or black. Silver is not bad. All right, come on. You guys got to yell at the screen so I can hear you. Even though this video isn't live. All right, how about blue? What do you think about blue? Let's look at it. Blue's good. Yeah. I'm feeling the blue. Man, this is a nice car. I got to get rich so I could buy one of these. Well, actually, I could probably buy this now. <laughs> I should go get it. Mm-hmm. This one automatic, only 24,000. Eight speed, three accidents. Uh oh. <laughs> Let's see, they're going to show us the car facts on this one. Let's see. All right, here we go. It's car facts, Tom, baby. 51,000 miles. Damage. Did the. Minor damage, more minor damage. Airbag did not. De vehicle involved in a side swipe collision with another motor vehicle. Ouch. They're probably jealous. They probably got beat in a race. That's what happened. The Dodge Challenger can never be beaten in a race. Unless it's racing the GTR, which then it could lose. Maybe. Dep I guess it depends on what Dodge Challenger. All right, those are my two favorite cars. So they can't race. They have to tie. All right, damage the left front and the left side. <laughs> oh, good. Stop beating people in races, then they'll stop sideswiping you. All right, a <laughs> minor. All right, I got the oil change. <laughs> oh, man. They keep getting hit. Oil and filter, oil and filter. Oil and filter. Mission stuff. And then it's up for sale. All right, well. Goodness gracious. I definitely have somebody check that one out before you buy it. <laughs> it's been like three accidents already. All right. Well, it certainly does look cool. It looks pretty cool. Blue. That's a good color. All right. Maybe the three best colors are blue, orange, and black. All right. Those are the best colors. What color do you think is the best for the Challenger, you guys? Tell me in the comments. I'm telling you, these are going to be modern day classics. The V8 is gone after this year so you might as well get them now and then you'll be able to have them years into the future all right that's all i got for you today thank you for tuning in and have a good one